things that people may be thinking about at this point is, okay, earth oven, great. I think I can build one. I certainly like the food that uh, you can cook in it, and I like the way it looks and all. What about the rest of the world, though? What if I were to present this to a business, a restaurant, whatnot, or my mother, or somebody that I know that might be interested and they've never seen one before, they don't know what they're for. What do I do then? Well, what you're looking at here, I hope you can see, is the opportunity. Because at this point, you're looking at something that's completely exclusive, completely unique, completely singular, uh, something that's only from you and then to present it as a business or to present it as a product, something that you can make and something that would be very unique and very, very eye-catching and mouth-watering for all of the customers that come in to the businesses, uh, something uh, that will, will catch people's attention. So what I'm also offering here is opportunity. You have a chance here to do something unique. How often do you see things unique these days? Um, there is a lot of innovation going on all around us, yes, but uh, of this type, I don't think so. I think you, if you look around, you won't see this, this kind of a, an offering in many of the restaurants or, or even in just in people's houses. Uh, people that like to have unique things like this uh, at their place and people that like to throw dinner parties and whatnot. You can offer this as something that uh, nobody else has and you're the go-to person. You provide the quality, you provide the Cadillac, uh, you've got examples to show, at least one, and samples to show. You could bring them over, have them sample some of something that uh, you're cooking in your own oven and uh, then this ought to get you off and rolling the best way to sell an oven by the way the best way to get people interested in one of these maybe not a mobile one but an oven at any rate is to build one and have it out there in public view people come by and they're like i've just got to ask you what the hell are you doing and uh, this is where people come from. This is where the interest arises. And this is where your market is grown from. So one strategy I'd like to, to leave you with before we go here is maybe you can offer somebody that's in a quite public location. Uh, in a location, the oven would be in a location where a lot of people would be walking or driving by and seeing the oven in process. And then they would, uh, if they're locals and they're coming by often, they'll get to see it step by step and they'll get to see it finish up. And hopefully a little excitement will be created there. And then finally, as people are, uh, many people are so curious, they will just stop their car, they'll stop walking, they'll come in and then they'll just have to know what's going on and where did you get this groovy idea to make such a thing? And, and what's it used for, et cetera, et cetera, and then you're off to the races. So I would, I would do this in a place um, for free if you, if you cannot get a price out of this uh, for a friend, for somebody that you know, as a grantee's offering to get your business rolling. Um, yeah, it's a lot of work. It's a lot of hassle uh, to be doing something um, and to not be compensated, but you always at least work for expenses. In other words, whoever is got that oven, is getting that oven from you, have them feed you, have them take care of you, transport you if necessary, bring you to the supply shops uh, to where you're not having to headache over any of these details. Um, your customer, your client is uh, taking care of that for you. So if you're not getting paid on that initial offering, uh, you're at least going to get, you have a good shot of getting clientele. There's going to be word of mouth. Uh, when you do build the oven, the customers in that place are going to be curious. They're going to want to know who built it. And then you have your little flyers that you have the, uh, the business pass out to those folks that are curious 
And then there again, there's another avenue by which you're off to the races. So I hope these tips help. Uh, there is a distinct opportunity here. I think it's very fresh and alive and something new. It's something that people are not expecting. It's not electronic. It's not made of, it's not using gas. It's using materials that are just around us. It's very practical. Makes high, high quality food, high quality product that people will remember you for. And uh, what's, what's not to love there? So give it a thought and hope to see you inside.